Good morning guys, welcome back. I am heading out on a float trip. We're taking a kayak, gonna do some fishing on the Stanton River here in Central Virginia. We'll see how it goes. They say it's gonna be up a little bit because they're letting out more water than normal, but um, I don't, we'll see how it goes. Getting everything ready, it's, our, it's not that early actually. It's only uh, 7.45, where's the clock? There it is, um, but that's it. So I got everything in the Jeep and we're gonna be heading out. I'll talk to you guys in just a little bit. Alrighty, we made it out on the Stanton and we are, it's me, Chad, Kimmy Sue, and Kylie. We're gonna see what we catch. Let me put this on the chest rig and have some fun. River conditions are perfect. Nice. We are going from Dalton's down to Alta Vista. All right, guys, I did have one just a second ago. And before I could get the camera turned on, he went down above a bunch of downed trees. He wrapped up around the trees and broke me off. I've only got eight on this one, eight pound test. Fluorocarbon, mono, whatever the heck it's called. So it wasn't much for him to chomp it off or break it off. Might have been a cat because it's deep. It's probably six, maybe eight foot deep right here. Um, and we're in like an eddy as you see the leaves are coming back right here So this might be a nice little pool. It's fast out in front of me In the main river I will spin around and show you But uh, it might have been a cat came up through there because it was big. I mean it just grabbed it and took off It did not give me a second All good, All good. Ah, had another one. They're down in the bottom here. I'm dropping it and letting it sink. Here it's not quite as deep. It's probably four foot. Let's get with the others. I'm going to fish this little log jam out here around the edge of it real quick. I have that top water bait on also, the Whopper Flopper. And I have not gotten any hits on that. So, we're gonna fish this side, the other side, and then we're gonna take off with everybody else because they're way down there. We had somebody nibbling right over here. Let's see if we get him again. He's right behind that rock. Nope, not that time. But we will slam into this one, so let's try to keep away from him. That's pretty cool. Somebody did a turtle on that rock over there. That's awesome. We're going to try right behind this log here. Oh, had him. Let's do that again. What's going on, Miss Kylie? You slaying them? I know, I heard it was a monster. Like it could have went in my fish pond. Yeah. 
You having fun now? Yeah. Cool. Oh, every day. Uh, I had that one break me off in the wood. Yeah. And then I had one other small one. That was it. Uh, Nothing to brag about. Nothing. Nothing. That is stinking. You're using the same thing your dad uses. Yeah. Like daughter, like father. Uh, what's it called? Uh, Ned Rake. Okay. Yeah, that's what he calls it. There's a lot of grass in here right now. Yeah, there is. Alrighty guys, we have changed over to a little paddle tail. It is Lost Creek. I get them from um, uh, Sportsman's Warehouse. Sorry, I couldn't think of the name. I got a little weight on the front just so I could get down between the limbs of the logs and stuff. I got it weedless. But we haven't been getting much. I mean, a lot of small hits. But still gonna try. Gonna keep on. They seem to be up in the wood, you know, anywhere where there's structure. Um, not as much in the rock, but they're in the wood. Tracked any stripers that might be in here, or white bass. I do, or if I do, catch on to something. Alright, I forgot to start the GoPro. Here's one. He's probably three, three pounds smally. Oh my gosh, I don't know if I'm going to get him in. He's hooked pretty good. Get over here. Get in here. Whoo! That's a good hook. Good hook set. There you go, buddy. We're gonna try to see if there's any more in these little pools. Because it's right after the rapids. We're going to actually go back up there. And see what we can get. It's right after the rapids. And there's like a pocket of slack water. And I was dragging it along the bottom. Giving it a little jig. Twitching. And with the weedless hook set up. It does not get hung up as bad. You know in the grass. Because there's a lot of grass. So let's try another one. There might be something over there. And then we'll get back up around those rocks. All right, this is what I'm looking for. That little bit of current coming around the back of these rocks. And we'll try a couple of these spots. I'm trying to stay out of it. Because there's a couple rocks here, here, here. And there's slack water behind them. And I'll jig it down to the bottom. The bigger ones will be down in the bottom. But I brought a battery pack and a cable. So we will be able to um, plug into that. I won't be able to obviously put it underwater, but it'll give me an external battery and I'll just run the cable behind me and uh, go that route. Yeah, we're going to sneak right up in here. Try over there behind that other rock and branches. People will float through here fairly quick. There'll be a couple of serious fishermen, but a lot of people just float through, make a couple casts, and hopefully get anything. But we're going to try to stay right behind here. And I'll cast, there's, I see, breaks up there also, like right over there. And we'll just keep bouncing it through here. Obviously, they're in here. Oh, it's looking good,
Sorry guys, I forgot to turn on the GoPro again. Top water bait though, top water. That was good, that was fun. Let's hook out, there we go. Yeah, they seem to be uh, anxious for the top water action here. We're gonna keep throwing this guy for a little bit. Let me leave this guy on. But it was small. There he is. Hopefully you guys got that one. And I gotta pick up the pace. He's a little guy. What in the heck kind of? That's like a sucker. That is a huge creek chub. We're not even going to deal with him. And I'm going in here sideways. We're in trouble. All right. Let me turn this thing around. Actually, we're going backwards. So we got to spin around real quick. Paddle up. That was one of the biggest creek chubs I've ever seen. If I was catfishing, that would have been fun. Could have used him. All right, let's get through this rapids right here. Make sure I'm recording. Yep, okay. Got a couple rocks up ahead. There we go. Man, I'll turn. Uh, where are we going? None of this looks fun. I guess we're going to drop through right over here. Would be good. There we go. We're going to spin around because I'm going to try fishing this little eddy right here. There he is, right on the landing. Oh, I missed him. I mean, it just landed. I was hoping it was a little deeper back in here. Ah, right, little guy. <laughs> Oops, a daisy. That's going to be a mess. Oh, gone. So far. I'll go this way. You can stay there. I'm good. You have a good evening. All righty, guys. I have not been doing much on the kitchen. Been a lot of fishing. Didn't want to bore you with that. This is like the best bed set, the best set of rapids that they have on this trip. And it's flowing a little better than normal. So that's gonna be good. It's got to keep it straight.
right, that's it. We're calling it quits. We fished, didn't catch. She caught a bunch of trees. Hey, two fish. Two fish, she got two. Mm -hmm. I got like three, but it still was not fun. So, sorry for the boring video and I will get back to you on another one.